In this Photoshop video tutorial, I am going to show you how you can create a membership card by simply using an action script that I will give you as a bonus for purchasing this course. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing we're going to do, believe it or not, is not go to file. We're actually going to go to the action script itself. Now I already have my actions up as you see here, but if you don't, just go to window and make sure action is checkmarked or you can use the shortcut code Alt and F9. Right now I'm going to go ahead and press on membership card. And that opens it up and we're going to do start. Press the play button. And this is our template. Um, just in case you're wondering about the size of it, it is 1488 by 902. Um, 300 resolution because this uh, my friend Max Swilski actually created this action script um, and when he designed it he designed it in case someone wanted to print membership cards so 300 resolutions actually for uh, a print but if you want to go down to web uh, resolution it's simply 72 sorry I clicked something wrong there um, 72 click OK if you want to change that now it makes our card look a little smaller, so let's go increase it by hitting Control Plus. A little too large. There we go. Now, first thing I want to do, um, I want to go ahead and leave the background on the card here, just like it says. These two layers, name them the way they are, and that's very important. I want to create a new layer, and I want to go ahead and give this a gradient. I'm going to go over here, gradient. And I do want a shade of blue, but I don't want that shade of blue. Um, let's go with something a little lighter. Press on our stopper. I'll go with this shade in here. We'll click on a little, little lighter. And then, of course, we'll just go ahead and Press Shift, draw a line. Now I think I want to reverse that. Oh, actually, I had reverse on, so let's go ahead and do Control Z, make sure reverse is off, and do that again because I want the dark up top and the light at the bottom. There we go. Now let's go ahead and give this a little bit of a style. I'm going to create another new layer. I'm going to use my Shapes tools and go with the rectangle here. I'm going to make sure it's on shape, I'm going to fill it, and we're going to use it like a red. And we'll just draw a box right here. Strip like that. And let's go ahead and move that down a little bit. Now, I'm going to create another new layer. And then I'm going to press type, and I'm going to give this uh, some numbers like you would like on a credit card or a membership card. We change the font to gold color. Um, that way, uh, gold, you know, um, valuable, your VIP or, or something like that. So I'm going to use um, the code hex code FFD800. And we will do um, right here. And we'll just do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There we go. Move this down a little bit. Maybe over a little bit too as well. Kind of center to where we like it. That should be fine. Click here. And let's go ahead and give this a little bit of uh, um, um, some FX on here. Let's go ahead and give it a little bit of stroke. I'm going to do an outer stroke of one. And let's make it black and not red. Give some double and emboss. Maybe a little bit of contour. That should be fine. And let's go ahead and um, going back to our rectangle, I forgot to do this, sorry. 
let's go ahead and give this a like a white stroke on the inside. We're not going to do the exact shade of white. We're just going to, since we're going to do this on the inside, not on the outside. Increase the size just a little bit. Give it a little more style. And let's go back up here, create a new layer. Another layer of text. And I'm going to go ahead and leave that like that. Increase the size a little bit. Let's say, let's make it, let's do 36 to begin with, see what that looks like. And we'll just um, type out the word membership card. And that looks good. So let's just go ahead and uh, make sure that this is centered. And I want to center it this way. I don't want to center it. It doesn't matter if it's between up and down, but I do want to make sure it's in the center of the card there. Press Control D. And then we'll do one more layer. And um, my friend Mark Austin has a website called Resell Rights Weekly. So I'm going to just go ahead and do um, another type layer, and we'll just do RRW. And I'm going to go ahead and go with that. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do Control T, and since RRW, I'm going to go ahead and make this so it matches right flush with the membership card. Give it maybe a little more height. And we're going to either press enter or we can press up here. Now, um, I could give this some stroke. In fact, let, let's go do that. And this time we're going to do the outside stroke. I'm just going to leave it white. But let's, um, let's make this one. It's a little too, too thick that. And let's just do okay. Well, let's go ahead and also I'll give it some bevel and boss. Um, that's a little hard. Let's get, let's cut the depth down a little bit. Actually, I'm gonna go ahead and um, copy that layer style. I actually like that layer style. So let me go ahead and paste that same layer style over to the membership card and let's also go just go ahead and do um, change over and do the uh, numbers that way yeah I don't like the numbers let's let's forget that okay let's just do those the way they are anyway now that we have all that done now we can go to compile and click play And there you go, there you have your membership card. Now if you don't want the white background, that's no problem. You can get rid of that. Um, just turn off the uh, background there and you can save it as a PNG. I'm just call this RRW membership card. And you can save it as a, I'm, I'm, I want to keep this, so I'm going to, have to save it as a PSD so I can use this later. But let's say you want to save it at, for your website, you can go, you can save it as a JPEG. Of course, it will give you the white background though. Um, but if you do it as a PNG, it will let you do it as transparent. Um, but like I said, I'm going to just go ahead and keep it this way. And that's all that's to it. And like I said, I will give you this, as, this action script as a bonus. And uh, I might be able to give you some more stuff, too, from Max. Um, uh, I did buy a good PR package off of him, and I'd like to share that with you. Um, anyway, that's the conclusion of this video. Hope you enjoyed it. See you in the next one.